Hi everybody, it's Honest John again. Now, I could have predicted yesterday's Supreme Court decision months ago. In a 5-4 to four decision, the court ruled in favor of Hobby Lobby, saying that they have the right to deny medical services, in this case birth control, to their female employees. This is another example of judicial activism gone wild by the conservative members of the court. The Constitution makes no mention of the rights of corporations. The Founding Fathers did not intend for them to have any constitutional rights. Only people are mentioned in the Constitution. And yet the Robert Courts has repeatedly assigned rights to corporations that they were never meant to have. Every time they have done that, the rights of individuals have been infringed on. So now the Supreme Court has ruled that the religious beliefs of the employees of Hobby Lobby mean nothing. Their bosses can dictate what religious beliefs they may follow. Who knows, they might even be able to dictate what churches they go to and what rites they observe. This ability of corporate fat cats to dictate how employees practice their religion shreds the establishment clause of the Constitution. Just as the Supreme Court diminished the, the freedom of speech of individuals by assigning it to corporations, now they have taken away religious rights and given those to the rich and powerful. As long as the conservative members of the, of the court continue their assault on the rights of individuals, our Constitution will have the same value as a roll of toilet paper. The only hope for this country is that Roberts, Thomas, Alito, Scalia, and Kennedy die as soon as possible. I would wish them a slow and painful death but it's more important that they die quickly. Thanks for listening.